Let me study 13th question of gate 2022. Titanium is produced commercially by option A smelting reduction of titanium oxide TiO2, option B thermal dissociation of TiH2, option C reduction of TiCl4 by magnesium, and option D reduction of TiO2 by hydrogen. Let me briefly explain the extraction processes for titanium. The most common ores used for extraction of titanium are rutile and ilmenite, where ilmenite contains significant amount of iron oxide in it. Let us look at the steps in treating ilmenite for titanium extraction. The first step involved in treating ilmenite is the smelting of the ore with carbon, which is carbothermic reduction where iron is in molten form with titanium oxide as a slag and carbon monoxide gas. The slag obtained after the carbothermic reduction is not pure titanium oxide and it contains some amount of iron oxide. The slag has to be further refined to generate high grade titanium oxide for which it is subjected to the next step that is leaching. As we know, leaching is a hydrometallurgical process where the slag is washed continuously with liquid to preferentially separate the unwanted metal from the slag. Here, iron is preferentially dissolved in HCl and will be washed away and the residue that is obtained is high grade TiO2. This high grade TiO2 is then subjected to halogenization or chlorination where TiO2 is reduced in the presence of carbon at 1000 degrees Celsius to obtain TaCl4 in gaseous state and oxygen. This TaCl4 vapor is further subjected to metallothermic reduction that is it is reduced with other metals such as magnesium or sodium. When magnesium is used as a reducing agent it is called as Kroll's process. When sodium is used as reducing agent, it is called as Hunter's process. So, the correct option is option C, which is Kroll's process.